Hi everyone, Anthony Morganti here. Recently, Adobe announced price increases for some of their photography plans. In this video, I'm going to teach you everything you need to know about it. And I created this handy dandy slideshow to help me explain it. Now, as I mentioned, recently Adobe announced changes to the pricing structure of its photography plans, which will see an increase across some of their tiers. These plans include access to Lightroom and Photoshop and additional features like cloud storage. If you're using an Adobe photography plan, here's a detailed breakdown of what you can expect. Now, if you are a current subscriber or you're thinking of subscribing to the 20 gigabyte photography plan, this plan includes Lightroom, Lightroom Classic, Photoshop, and 20 gigabytes of cloud storage. The current price is $9.99 a month or $119.88 a year. The new price is $14.99 a month. That's a $5 a month increase. That's a 50% increase. But new subscribers, if you're thinking of subscribing to this, or existing monthly subscribers, you could lock in the current price of $9.99 a month by switching to a yearly plan before January 15th, 2025. This will run $119.88 a year. So if you want to keep paying $9.99 a month, before January 15th, you have to convert to a yearly plan and pay $119.88 a year. But it is my understanding that actually most photographers do not subscribe to this plan. They subscribe to the one terabyte photography plan. This plan includes Lightroom, Lightroom Classic, Photoshop, and one terabyte of cloud storage. The current price of this plan is $19.99 a month or $239.88 a year. The good news is there is no price increase for this tier. So if you subscribe to this plan, this specific plan, you will not see a price increase, uh, at least not in the next few months. There is another plan though. There's a Lightroom only plan. This plan includes Lightroom, Lightroom Classic, and one terabyte of cloud storage. The current price of this plan is $9.99 a month or $119.88 a year. This plan is going to see a price increase of $2 a month. It will come out to $11.99 a month. That's a 20% increase. Now, like the 20 gigabyte photography plan, you can lock in the lower price. So if you are an existing monthly subscriber to the Lightroom plan, or you're a new subscriber thinking of subscribing to the Lightroom plan, you need to subscribe yearly before January 15, 2025. That will then run you $119.88 a year. So those are the pricing changes for the different photography tiers that Adobe offers. Now, I was wondering, why is Adobe increasing pricing? So I, um, I looked at their press release and I read some stuff on their blog. And I kind of paraphrased their reasons for raising prices. Now, again, this isn't me saying this. This is them explaining why they're raising prices. Uh, number one is constant innovation. Introducing features like generative fill, advanced AI tools, and improved masking capabilities are examples of Adobe's investment in cutting-edge technology. These updates come with significant development costs. Number two, cloud infrastructure enhancements. Adobe's cloud storage has become integral to its ecosystem, allowing users to edit and store files across devices seamlessly. They increase cost support maintenance and further expansion of these services. And finally, operational costs. Adobe cites global economic shifts and inflation as contributing factors to updated pricing structure. And I think we all could agree that prices have been going up on pretty much everything. So that is their reasoning for raising prices. Now, I do want to stress too, that if you are an existing monthly customer and you're subscribing to that 20 gigabyte photography plan or to the Lightroom plan, um, the, the price increases will be reflected in your next billing cycle. So again, if you want to lock in the lower price, you need to convert to a yearly billing cycle before January 15, 2025. So really that's everything you need to know about these um, price increases we're seeing uh, with Adobe's photography plans. Thank you, everyone who watches my videos. I really do appreciate it. Talk to you guys soon.